while I made it to the lake. Got a five to seven mile per hour breeze today. She rides very well. Not quite in the middle of the lake yet. We're headed that way. I like some rain over there. I think it's gonna miss me though. The wind's coming from that direction. It looks pretty clear. Yeah, she handles well. I mean, there's no difference in rod, really. From full throttle to cruise. I mean, the difference in speed, but it rides pretty well over the waves. You just feel a slight little bump, that's all. I love that cable steering. It doesn't move. It stays where you put it. It's old school. Simple to maintain. Simple to service and replace. Didn't bring much with me today. Life vest, paddle, a few drinks in that box of first aid kit, flare gun kit, an air horn. Brought some extra fuel. I don't think I'll need it. I brought the anchor just in case. My number is on the side in these little plaques. I still didn't receive my registration sticker that goes right here. I tried calling wildlife fishes today. That was a 40 minute wait. I, I hung up. You know, but uh, the agent who inspected it put the sticker on the rear. Told me as long as I really had that sticker, that's all I really needed. But it is Louisiana requirement to have your numbers and registration posted on the both sides of the vessel. So I'm gonna put it eventually, whenever I get it. Yeah, I made it to the lake. It's a pretty calm day. I stayed at five to seven mile an hour winds. So it's really a really a great day to ride small boats in this lake. This lake, uh, I want to say it's like two and a half, three miles wide, about, about six miles long. And it connects to another smaller lake on that side. And on this side is a, a town called Dulac. In fact, there's a Dulac swing bridge over there. There's a Dulac water tower and further up is the town of Grand Caillou, Louisiana. And on this side is a bunch of marsh and bayous that I, I love cruising. And that over there would be the Chauvin water tower. And that is the Boudreaux Canal Bridge, the main pass where I came in at. And there's the channel markers that lead you straight into Dulac. I don't believe we're going to Dulac today. Today's cruise is just, well, while I had time. I want to see how well she handled open water and man she's doing good really good a little bit of rock but not much let's go against the wind on this one I hear some water lapping I'm very happy with the way this boat turned out she rides so well very well better than I expected plastic barrels to be I don't know is this good I would have built one years ago it's never too late to build the things you want do it while you're young and capable I waited a little late in my life to be adventurous start going camping nature trails but I always wanted a houseboat and growing up that's all my dad talked about I guess it's a, it's a dream of every man down here that grows up on a bayou to own a houseboat spend a weekend on the lake or on the waters but not a lot of us get to do it unless we're working you know when you're catching shrimp for a living you catch the majority of shrimp at night you know, some people down here spend four or five nights just live on a boat, really. 
sleep all day or well, most of the day and catch shrimp at night for pocket change there's no price on shrimp right now but I tell you the shrimp are beautiful and there's no price the only time the price goes up is when they don't have shrimp or the shrimp is really small then the price on the larger shrimp goes up because there's none available I guess I'm gonna take out a gear and just go with the wind. I can enjoy some of that breeze because if I'm going with the wind, I don't feel the breeze. I start sweating. But if I take out a gear, I get that, that beautiful breeze. Man, she's so stable. Hey, today would be a good day to come swim in the lake. Another time, I reckon. Thank y'all for stopping by. I appreciate the views, uh, the comments, if any, suggestions. You know, if remarks, good or bad, they're all welcome. We all have an opinion. I like to hear them. Thank y'all for the ride. Catch y'all on the next one.